is to collect all the plants that you want to keep outside for the summer. And once you get them outside, there are two things you can do for them immediately that will make them very happy. The first thing is to clean their foliage, and the second one is to leach them. Yes, I do mean leech them. While well, that may conjure up thoughts of blood-sucking insects being put on their leaves, that's not what I mean. What I mean by leaching is you want to flush their soil very thoroughly so that the soluble salts that have built up over the past year or years is all flushed out. And now that happens from using fertilizers and simply from using water in your plants. So it's a really good thing to do once a year. And I'll show you what the soluble salts look like. You can see on this plant here that it has actually quite a buildup of soluble salts all around the edge. All that is just chemicals. And you can also see it around the bottom of the pot, especially near the holes. And I'm sure that if you check out some of your plants at home, you'll see something similar on at least a few of them. So now we're going to get out the hose and leach them. We'll get out the hose right over here. There we go. Now when you do this, you want to make sure to give them a lot of water. For example, this 10-inch plant here should get at least a few gallons of water going through it. So we'll go ahead and put some water on them. Then we'll come back and fill them up again so that every single one of them is thoroughly flushed. It's really a very simple thing to do, but it really helps the plant out because the soluble salts can actually keep the roots from taking in water like it should. So this ought to do it. Now the second thing you want to do while you've got your hose out is to go ahead and clean off the foliage. Now I really recommend using a gentle spray when you're going to do that and I'll get my gentle sprayer right now and put it on the hose. Now when you do this, you're getting rid of dust that keeps the plant from breathing as well as it could or from taking in light as well as it could too. So this is a wonderful thing to do for them. And again, it shouldn't be too much trouble. So just get your hose on again and spray away. Except that my sprayer doesn't want to go on. <laughs> Here we go. It's good to know how your sprayer works before you get out here to spray your plants. Okay, now that we got it going, we'll give it nice, make it nice and gentle for them. Just go ahead and make sure everyone gets a good soaking. Both of these things are a great thing to do and you really only have to do them once a year and this is the best time of year for it. They'll thank you later when you've got gorgeous plants at the end of the summer. <laughs>